Well, after taking months of preparation for a small local film crew, production for their monster movie is now underway. The crew is utilizing many locations around southern Alberta and in Lethbridge. We caught up with the film crew to find out what exactly goes on behind the scenes of an independent feature production. Brendan Miller has more. Uh, scene 69, shot 500, take two. All is quiet on set. Action, Scott. Action! Hours of preparation spent just to shoot a five-second scene. Writer-director Blake Everton requires every detail be perfect. I was wondering if we'd get a bit of the edges of the door frame in. This University of Lethbridge new media student decided to create a hybrid Western monster film for his master's thesis project. The film is loosely based on environmental concerns that a small rural farming community faces. There was definitely an, an inspiration about uh, human arrogance, especially in their dominance over nature, and uh, I, um, especially in this day and age with all the environmental concerns that we're dealing with and all the questionable decisions that we make as far as the environment goes. The crew is under a tight schedule with only 19 days to shoot their 80-minute production. Sometimes you find that I storyboarded more shots than I needed, that we could sort of combine shots, or that it wasn't necessary to see certain uh, elements of the creatures, that we could allude to them instead. The most we can get out of everyone, switching over jobs, giving each other's hands, makes it go a lot quicker. The production team was able to find sponsors and rent some of their high-end equipment, like this camera, which is similar to that used to shoot The Hobbit, from the Calgary Society of Independent Filmmakers. Without the camera we have, without the lighting equipment, we're not going to have a movie. It's not going to look like a feature film. The film follows the town sheriff, played by local actor John Bowers. It's always fun to kind of put yourself in another situation and just sort of explore and uh, kind of see from a different perspective, you know, the, the world around you. Bauer's role will see him dealing with the concerns of local residents as strange animal sightings occur. I'm a big fan of the fact that regardless of what humankind does next, nature will still be here. And uh, so sooner or later, the balance will be restored. Brendan Miller, CTV News, Lethbridge. The film called Prairie Dog will wrap up shooting later this week.